This instructional film is intended to demonstrate the application of axle heel solo alongside compression bandages. Our process starts once the primary dressing has been applied to the wound. Make sure you have everything ready and close to hand to ensure an efficient dressing change for your patient. Prior to applying Axel Heal's electrode pad, ensure any excessive dry skin is removed and avoid using emollients. The selected area needs to be cleaned with the wipes provided within the treatment pack. This preparation will ensure a good adhesion of the electrode pads. Apply the Axel Heal pads as close as possible to the wound site on healthy skin either side of the wound, but ensure the pads are applied away from the area covered with the primary dressing. If the wound has excessive exudate, place the pads horizontally to avoid the pads becoming too wet from gravitational moisture. You are now ready to apply compression bandages. Follow the manufacturer instructions for applying the compression bandages, ensuring that the electrode wires are fed through the compression bandage and not in direct contact with the skin to avoid any pressure injuries. Once you have completed the compression bandages, you are ready to connect the Axel Heal Solo device to the electrode pads. Connect the treatment device to the electrode pads by pushing the electrode connectors into the electrode pad receptors. Activate the treatment by pressing the Start Pause button down for two seconds. Secure the device using the provided removable clip and strap ensuring it is placed away from bony prominences, such as the tibial crest. Secure any free wires with tape. Each Axel Heal treatment device runs for the full 12-day treatment, after which time it will switch off automatically. The dressing and bandages can be changed according to clinical need and local policy. The device needs to be disposed of in a wee recycling facility. The treatment consists of one device, making it a single 12-day treatment course. The Axel Heal Therapy delivers repeated treatment sessions with a resting period, which are repeated throughout the 12-day treatment period. Further instructional videos on device change and troubleshooting are available.